Hi, Fiona. Hi, Fiona. Hi. Could you tell us about your meeting? How did it go? Um, it was. It went very well, actually. Um, it went on a lot longer than I had thought he'd give me, but um, it was very productive, and um, we talked about everything. I have to say, and um, I'm hoping now that he's, there was a good few notes been taken, and I'm hoping that um, something will be done. Did, did you have any requests for him? Did you ask him anything to do anything for you? I did. I asked for a minimum sentence to be put on to, um, especially for rapes and uh, assaults and stuff. I asked for younger judges. I asked for the judges to be sensitised and trained in handling um, cases like my own. And did he, what did he say to you in response to those questions? He just said he'd take it on board. Was there an emotional meeting for a Fiona? It was because um, he actually really wanted to know my story and he wanted to know some of the, the details and he wanted to know about the, the court process and stuff so it was a bit emotional I had to uh, stop a few times <laughs> what did, that, what did, you? did that surprise you? yes yes I didn't think um, kind of you know there's a good few days between my father being locked up and today and I, I didn't think I'd still be as um, emotional about it what did you ask him in relation to minimum sentencing and what kind of response did he give you on that issue? I just thought it was important that I felt the sentence that my dad got um, made me feel I wasn't worth I wasn't worth anything. You know, that my, my story wasn't worth anything, that what happened to me wasn't worth anything because of the sentence he got. So I just explained that to him. So hopefully um, that can make a difference. 